What's up guys, welcome back to LSJ TV for today's video. Just got back from the placement and I'm cooking dinner here as you can see. Uh, this is eventually going to be, what would you what would you call it? Okay, chicken fried... fried chicken rice. and egg fried rice. Chicken and egg fried rice. Um, so we're making some of that, as you can see the ingredients on the side there. We'll just put some vegetable and bean sprout uh, mix in there. That was, like, that was like one pound from Tesco and they're normally on offer as well. So you can get one of those. Uh, we'll show you that when it's finished. Uh, but we just got back from town now actually, uh, celebrating with the Nottingham Panthers. They've actually won the European Cup and had a little uh, sort of get together, a gathering celebration with all the fans in the city centre. We don't live that far away and so we thought we'd go be a little bit patriotic to Nottingham, go and support the Nottingham Panthers and show them some support, take some pictures and stuff like that. So I'll put some clips on the screen for you now. Ladies and gentlemen, your historic British ice hockey team, your European champions, the Continental Cup champions for 2017, the Nottingham Panthers. And again guys, I'm going to carry on making this dinner and I'll catch up with you guys later. That feeling when you're making chicken and egg fried rice and you forget to make the rice. Right guys, so here's the finished product. It doesn't actually look that appetizing, but trust me, it tastes pretty damn good. Uh, so I'm going to top that with a little bit more soy sauce and I'm going to enjoy this. So I'll see you guys later. How's it going guys? Hopefully you're enjoying the video so far. If you are, then let me know by leaving a like, comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel for loads more great new content. Hopefully I'm going to get a new gorilla pod fairly soon because as you can tell from these viewing angles, I don't actually have one at the minute. Normally I would wrap it around something, stand it up on the floor, but actually I managed to break it so I'm just doing the best I can with the equipment that I have available to me. But also bearing that in mind guys, I didn't actually have the ability to record every single set purely because the gym was pretty busy as you can see in the background right now. I couldn't actually record every single set without the Gorilla Pod or without somebody to help me like I normally would. But I did my best. So as you guys saw there, I could record the bench press from behind there and I can record the one arm dumbbell row as you guys can see here. Uh, with it supported on the bench. The next movement of the day was the incline bench and now this is actually becoming really easy in my opinion so I'm going to up the weight next week and incorporate more and more pause reps just to break down those muscle fibres, make as many gains as possible. And again the last set I actually managed to record, apologies for the short commentary today guys, but the last exercise I actually managed to record was the bicep curl and so really focusing on those New Year's resolutions, really focusing on building that peak and really focusing on building that overall better physique. So that is it for this short commentary today guys, and enjoy the rest of the video. Right guys, so the next thing I'm going to do is make some muscle mousse, stick this in the fridge and probably have it for pudding uh, tomorrow night. So uh, this video is kind of turning into almost like a full day of eating. I'm going to make a, a couple of meals uh, over the next couple of videos. So if you want me to do a specific full day of eating in terms of what a student eats, how to eat on a budget, then let me know in the comment section. Let me know by leaving a like, as always guys, because that actually does help the channel out a lot more than you expect. So if you've seen my muscle move review from probably a couple of months ago now, uh, you put 150 milliliters of water in your favorite shaker, uh, along with two scoops of the mix, put it in the shaker, shake it for around about 30 seconds, make sure it's nice, nice and thick texture, and then what I usually do is just put it in a, in a glass, which you're in a glass or a container or something like that, something which you're able to get a spoon in, because obviously you're gonna eat this with a spoon. So, uh, ah, here we go. Thing, the first thing that comes to mind, this is just an old uh, Nutella jar. So that's on nice and tight, as you can see there, my my protein shaker. Get that nice and shaken up there. And then you'll feel it thicken up as you're shaking it. Because I, uh, I don't know the science behind it actually, I don't know. I've always been really interested, if anybody knows anything about muscle mousse and how they make their products, because this is practically zero fat, and uh, I believe it's 20, 20 plus grams of protein per portion. But I think we're about there. 
And if you just look at the texture, if we can just get a nice close up, just see the consistency when you pour it out. It should be nice and thick like that. You don't want it to be all watery because that just means that it's going to, well, in my, from my experience, means that it's going to set a little bit quicker. And to be honest, it tastes a little bit nicer as well. So that is that. What we're going to do now is put that in the fridge, leave that overnight. It only takes two or three hours, but it's around about eight o'clock now. So we'll leave that in the fridge and we'll catch up with you guys later. Right guys, so just to quickly conclude this video, what I want you guys to do, the people who made it this far in the video, just to comment down in the comment section exactly what you guys want me to make. I had a suggestion a couple of weeks ago to show a bit more of the city. I know I've done a little bit of that in this video and I'm going to do it in the next couple of weeks as well. So thank you for that suggestion. And I'm asking you guys, the viewers, what you guys want to see. Because to be honest, I've been with, with my sister having a baby and placement and all that kind of stuff. It's... It's been a lot more difficult than normal to pump out the kind of content, the kind of quality content that I want for you guys. And that, hence the reason why this video is a little bit shorter and there's not as much information in it and all that kind of stuff. But all I want to know is just what exactly what you guys want to see, exactly what you guys like, exactly what you guys dislike. So whether you comment in this video, leave a like, send a message to my Instagram, send a message to my Facebook, anything like that, they're all linked below. So check them out, I, I post daily on all of them. So just check them out and let me know exactly what you want me to post. And then that way hopefully I can make the content exactly what you guys want to see and exactly what you guys are going to enjoy. So with that said guys, that's gonna round off today's video. Thanks a lot for watching, as always remember, no regrets. I'll see you guys in the next video.